Hello my Fox Hollow fam, I'm Ton and welcome to Baking with Fox Hollow Kitchen. Today we celebrate our moms. Looking back at one of the first recipes my mom ever showed me how to make was apple crisp. I just remember her always telling me cooking and baking great food is a simple way to show someone you care. Well, today I want to take her apple crisp to the next level. This episode we're going to show you how to make Dutch apple pie, flaky crust, baked apples in a crumbly topping perfection. So if you're ready, then let's have some fun. To start off our pie crust, we're going to go ahead and add a cup of flour. To that we're going to add a teaspoon of sugar, half a teaspoon of salt, a stick of butter cut down into small chunks, Put it all in our food processor here. And we're going to just pulse it down until it looks like small little pebbles. And let's see how we did here. All right, I think we're good to go. We're going to go ahead and proceed to the next step. All right, next up we're going to go ahead and just dump this into a big bowl here. And we're just gonna work it together with our hands, adding ice water as needed until it resembles a sticky ball. And then we are going to refrigerate it for two hours. All right, it's been two hours, so let's go ahead and roll our dough out here. Gonna go ahead and Roll it out to about 12 inches and then get ready for our pie pan. Okay, now that we've got this rolled out, we're going to go ahead and line our pie pan with it. Alright, next up we're going to go ahead and start our filling. Already in the bowl we already have cut up 8 cups of apples. You can use basically whatever apple kind of apple you like. I chose Fuji apples for this. To add to our filling we're going to have a half cup of sugar, a quarter cup of flour, a quarter of a teaspoon of cinnamon, and a tablespoon of lemon juice. And we're just going to mix this together until we get everything good and coated here. Now let's go ahead and add our apples to our pie crust. And if you guys get a whiff of these apples, oh my gosh, they smell good already. <laughs> so I'm really excited to be making this pie. And as a tribute to my mom. And we a little bit more here. Try and get it nice and even. Had one get away from me here, and one get away from me here. All right, we're going to go ahead and get our crumble topping ready to go then. All right, guys, let's go ahead and make our awesome crumble for this. We're going to start off with a cup of flour. To that, we're going to add two-thirds a cup of brown sugar and another stick of butter. And just kind of work it together with your hands until you start getting a nice little crumble here. Alrighty, I think our crumble looks awesome here. So let's go ahead and get it ready to go on top of our pie. Alright, let's go ahead and add our topping to our pie here. Just try and spread it out evenly. And keep in mind guys, for you guys watching at home, this is actually the first full-on pie I've ever made in my 
almost 40 years on this planet. So I'm kind of taking this as a big accomplishment. And I am very, very grateful for my mom and my grandmother, Marion Dotson, showing me how to cook and bake. Oh, this is gonna look so awesome. I'm so proud of myself with this. So, gonna go ahead and finish covering this and pop it in the oven at 400 degrees for about 45 to 55 minutes until the pie crust is golden brown and the pie filling is bubbly. Now it's time for my favorite part, the taste test. So here we go, let's get a little bite here. So good. For this being my first pie I've ever made, awesome. Wrapping up today, I want to thank y'all for joining me and encourage you to check out our friends and support channels listed in the description below. But before I go, first I want to say happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there, including my mom, Mary Hall. And just remember, good times and good food on Baking with Fox Hollow Kitchen. I'll see y'all soon. If you like this video or any of our other videos, be sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons and stay tuned for future shows.